ka makakuha ng BOQ appointment and your flight is in a week or so, ito po yung inyong gagawin. From my old video, I was thankful na I already showed you guys na kailangan ng passport as requirement for your BOQ. So yes, ang ating bagong requirements now strictly are your passport. And of course, your vaccination card with two of your doses. Passport na po talaga kailangan ngayon kasi kukunin nila yung passport number nito. Recently, my fiancé got his BOQ card. Doon ko nakuha yung mga requirements para ma-expedite yung inyong paghingi ng BOQ. So here are the procedure guys. Kailangan lang talaga na yung flight details nyo or yung flight ticket nyo is at least 7 to 10 days upon your request of the expedite. Yung main na sinabi ng personal na nandun sa BOQ is to just set an appointment any month, okay? So kahit anong buwan, kahit mapa-March pa yan ng 2022, basta meron pong appointment. The most important thing is na pasok na yung inyong mga details doon sa system. He does suggest na getting the appointment at about 12 midnight because 12 midnight, they refresh the ones that doesn't come in for their appointments. So those slots are opening up. That uh, 12 midnight and above is the best time to try to find an appointment. If you do find this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and even subscribe because I do have a lot of fun things coming up right next for fitness and triathlon and even for travel. From my last video, medyo hindi clear kung saan yung location ng BOQ. So when I went back there, ay kinunan ko na talaga kung paano papunta doon. And also, I will draw it for you. So here it goes. Okay, so we've got Malavasia right here. Alright, so the globe is right here. Okay, so this would be facing the sea. Alright. Okay. So this would be like the ecom center this would be the college on the side or the convention center whatever okay so nandito po siya okay so you'll find this walkway here papunta sa mga tricycles right also here there's the tricycles and jeeps okay so it's right here at the walkway it's on top it's on the second floor you'll see it there so, dyan po malapit yung BOQ na mo. Nasa taas po siya ng McDonald's. Okay, and Yoshinoya would be here. And there's also an entrance here of the Hypermark. That's not clear enough. Here are some more clues on how to get there. So, from the Hypermarket po, isa lang naman yung Hypermarket sa SM Mall of Asia. You will go under this walkway. And across the McDonald's, meron pong Zubuchon dun. There's a flight of stairs going up. So, yun po yung tamang daan para tumaas dun sa walkway. Meron naman pong stairs doon sa likod ng McDonald's. Pero, ginawa po nilang one-way yun. So, pababa lang daw po yung pwede dun. So, ito po yung tama para tayo makapunta sa BOQ entrance. Ito na po yung stairs na one way. So, hindi po pwedeng dumaan pataas. Pwede pong bumaba lang dyan. So, ito na po yung walkway na sinasabi ko dun sa drawing. Ayan po yung Moa Globe. Dun po yung Subuchon yung stairs kung saan tayo nang galing. And this is the hallway beside the McDonald's, which will lead you to the entrance of the BOQ office here at the Mall of Asia. Just keep walking towards the end of the hallway. There will be a lot of offices and stores as well 
At pag nakita niyo na po yung government services na office, yung sunod po nun ay yung BOQ office na. And once you arrive po sa BOQ office, sa harap po ng office, meron na pong personnel na mag-welcome all your questions and inquiries. Okay, I hope that helps. Good luck sa pagkuha ng inyong BOQ. Till the next time, my name is Coach Vanessa. Have a great day, guys. Bye!